Hello, hello, students and friends from North Carolina and United States. I am Ilze B. I am a Latvian and I teach Latvian for English speakers. Today I'm going to talk about Latvian name day tradition. That's because this was a request from my student Aina who won my challenge. She answered all the questions correctly that I posted on my Facebook page, Learn Latvian with Ilze B. So she wants to know more about the Latvian name day tradition. And this was also a question that was asked to me by my student Kevin, who wrote me an email and asked about name days of his relatives. So this is for you, Aina and Kevin, and of course this is for everybody else who is interested to learn more about Latvian name day calendar and about Latvian name day traditions. First of all, I'll tell you what I heard on YouTube once. There was a YouTube video where somebody talked about Latvians and Latvian traditions, and it was explained as if us Latvians all had our own saints, as if we were named after a saint, and the saint rules over one day in a calendar year of the church. So that would be our name day, but this is not accurate actually. Although I do believe that maybe Latvian name day tradition has originated in Russian Orthodox church traditions, but nowadays this is something very, very different. So even if it was truth once, it is not true anymore. Just think, my name, as far as I know, is not included in any church calendar. I don't know any saint that has a name Ilze or Ilze, but my name is included in Latvian name day calendar. In fact, my name is very popular in Latvia, and my name day is on January the 27th. So what is a name day? What does it mean to have a name day? Well, it means that you can have another day a year to celebrate apart from your birthday. So what you do on your name day probably is you go to work if you work in an office and you bring some treats with you and then you give those treats to your work colleagues during the coffee break and they bring you flowers and maybe some little gifts and you all celebrate your name days. And of course you receive congratulations on social media. If you are a child, then you even might have a party, just like your birthday party. So it's a fun thing to have, to have a name day. Now you might wonder, how do people know when your name day is? It's very simple. All biggest Latvian portals, news portals or entertainment portals or printed newspapers have the celebrated days written every day next to that day's date. So whenever you look at a Latvian portal, news portal or entertainment portal, find where you see the date written and next to the date there will be names that are celebrated on that day. That's how you know if your work colleague or your friend has a name day. But now I'll tell you more about the name day calendar and its organization. There is a special name day calendar commission that comes together periodically and decide what new names can be approved for the Latvian name day calendar. Why should new names be approved for the Latvian name day calendar? That's if some name that is foreign for the Latvian culture becomes popular. And how it happens is if a celebrity from another country, very often from the United States, but it could be also from the UK or anywhere else becomes popular and young parents want to give that celebrity's name to their newborn, or if a movie character becomes popular, or a character from a popular book is some something or somebody who the new parents like, they might 
give the name to their child and suddenly that name can become popular in Latvian culture as well. Of course the name gets Latvianized, so often you see names that look like British names or German names or Russian names, but they are Latvianized. They look a little different because Latvian names need to have the letters from the Latvian alphabet and they need to have endings the appropriate for the gender. And you know, there have been even conflicts between people whose names are not included in the Latvian name day calendar and the commission of the Latvian name day calendar. Because people want their names to be included in the Latvian name day calendar. And now I'll tell you about the criteria that the Name Day Expert Commission takes into regard when deciding upon whether or not to approve a name for the Latvian Name Day calendar. First is the origin of the name. The first hand is given to the names of Latvian or Lithuanian origin, then to the names of Germanic origin. Second is the meaning of the name. The names that have negative or ambiguous meaning should be avoided. The third is the euphony of the name. The names that are difficult for Latvians to pronounce should be avoided. The fourth is continuous use of the name. The names that have been used in the suggested form for a long time in Latvia are preferred. The fifth is the traditionality of the name. The names that have a significant place in the Latvian culture shall be approved. The sixth is the tradition of giving the same name, meaning that the names that have been given to people in the same family over the generations should be approved. The seventh is the number of people having the name. And this is not a decisive criterion. The preferred number is 20, but a name can be approved regardless if it complies with the other criteria. And finally, there is another condition. I call it the condition for names similar to those that are already on the calendar. If there already is a name on the calendar that is very similar to the one that is suggested, it should not be approved. And I'll give you an example. For instance, there is a name Angelica on the calendar, and that's why Angelica or Angelica would not be approved. To see examples of Latvianized names and download the latest list of the names on the calendar, visit my website ilzb.com and look for the post name day calendar name day tradition but in order to apply for your name to be on the latvian name day calendar submit your application to the name day expert commission of the state language center of latvia the address is valsts valodas centers exporta iela seši riga lv 10 10 all right, that's it for now. If you liked this video, please click like, comment, and share it. But I'll say bye-bye for now. Ata, till the next time.